Mecca, IPL. What is that? That is on here. The IPL is intense pulse light. This is for age spots. So remember. Yes, sir. Yes. The question is hydration. How important is it? And what do we do to make sure that the patient is adequately hydrated for these procedures? Um, I actually, hydration is not on my radar for these treatments. Maybe it should be. If I ask my team who does that, maybe it is. But in terms of hydration status for Forma, because really I am treating the very superficial elements. You can make a case that if they're appropriately hydrated, maybe they're a little bit more plump, that would be reasonable, but I don't think at the end of the day that affects your treatment for the positive or the negative. For the forma, for the forma. correct. For the other body sculpting things that I'm, oh, you mean like evolve? Same, same. But the things that I'm using, I'm using tumescent fluid, so it's a moot point at that point if I'm doing body type, face type, or acutype. So I don't think there's a play. Okay, that was IPL for sunspots, age spots, dyschromias vascular lesions, it's a, it's a light that's specifically targeted for reds and browns in the skin. Now, this is where it gets boring, hang with me, I'll clean up. In mode has the highest peak power and a left shifted, <clears throat> left shifted photon spectrum. What does that mean? What does all those words mean? That means that when our reds and browns live in this region, most IPLs are off to the right. They're not targeting precisely. Now, if you look at this graph, we left shifted our photon spectrum. So now we are more adequately and appropriately treating reds and browns. All of that means is efficiency. It's much more efficient. 